Hello guys, welcome back. I'm Julie and I'm here to do my reaction video for episode 16 of season 2 of, I think it's 16, of Supergirl. Uh, this episode comes after a, two, a week or two weeks hiatus, which has been a nightmare. Uh, but uh, yeah, I mean, what I'm expecting from this episode, I think it's going to be monel centric episode which <laughs> I didn't knew that all like we needed and it's like a specific episode to focus a lot more on monel but whatever you know it is what it is uh monel is a part of ouch of the show and do I need or do I want to learn more about him no but hey I love supergirl and I still want supergirl to be about supergirl so I'm waiting for that moment to come back, and yeah, I mean, I don't know, honestly, guys, I don't know. But I am excited because we are going to have Simmers, our two-minute quota for this episode. Also, I'm guessing, you know, I might be wrong, they might surprise us and have us had like a five minutes, five minutes of Sambers that will be insane, but that's not gonna happen. We're probably gonna get the two minutes like we always do. <sighs> Anyways, so next week it's episode 17, which it is a Sambers, a more Sambers centric episode. Do I believe that it's going to happen? No. But whatever. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction video. If you do, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe to see more reaction videos. I do reaction videos for a lot of shows. Um, and yeah. Also, check out my Patreon page if you want to support the channel. And that's about it. Let's just enjoy episode 16 of season 2 of Supergirl. <laughs> Arrived. I'm so happy to see Terry Hatcher. Wow, we are six seasons in and winter still hasn't come. <laughs> what? You know, since you got fired team. from Kako, your queue has gone down exponentially. Audrey Hepburn, the most romantic movie time. ever. Aww, they're sweet. Thanks. That smile. I'm just happy. Yeah, yeah, yeah like that. that. And butterflies in my stomach happy. Aww, mm -hmm. oh, that is sweet. It's so cheesy. It's like, it's like a rom-com on steroids. Cheesy. He's really cute. Let's see. Well, Two captors. We demand you turn over Monel of Daxum. Oh my god! Where he is Did you see that? Did you see that? Did you see that? They were cuddling! What happened? What? Oh my god! They were cuddling! When the transmission came through an unknown spacecraft in the lower atmosphere, right above the national. Two seconds of Sammers. Hell yeah. What? What? Does any of this look familiar to you? I've never seen a cruiser like that in my life. So we're searching Are you sure? To the ship, see if that gives us any indication as to who our new friends might be. But so far, no match. Agent. Oh, they are looking for. Where the hell is he? For Monet. Hi, <laughs> oh, he's on a date. Whoa. Oh. She likes to bite his oh, lip. Yeah. Why can't yeah. we have that with At with the National City? <gasps> Can you imagine if we have that wow. with you know, Maggie and Alex? The front door I will and die. Do, it's kind of Due to her. Uh, oh. 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 Break in and have divine museum sex then. Okay. Oh my okay. god, he's well, gonna get so complicated, so it just might take me. Oh. Hey! Well then be careful. Always oh, in. Respectfully disagree. Respectfully disagree. Alright, so did he oh, have to say that though? Oh shit. I'm assuming that wasn't friendly fire. A shield force. Oh! What the hell? She got her so she's losing altitude. I'm oh, trapped. Oh. I'm going up there, right behind you. No, no, wait, wait! I can do it. Is that a shield force or what? She's trapped in a bubble, literally. Okay. This is Monel Jackson. 
To the invaders, I will relinquish myself. But wait, how did they listen to that? Do they have a megaphone or some shit? Right what are you doing? Are you sure about this? Of course he is. This is Monel's journey to becoming a hero. I'm so excited for it. Some shit. Wasn't Daxon like dead too? We are very much alive, my son. Wasn't your dad like terrible or some shit? My apologies, Hero of Earth. Hero of Earth? Oh, these are my parents Queen Rhea and King Largand of Daxon. Which makes you the prince. The prince. Aww. You're just Our gonna prince. break his her heart. Thank the gods you're alive. And return to us at last. So tonight, we face. Oh, poor Kara. I'm also a hero. Well, trying to be with Kara's help. And you're not a hero, dude. You can't leave. You have no idea. Oh, poor Kara. You bitch. When did you say anything? Sailbridge Jones. What the hell? Is a party going on? Maggie! Maggie, my favorite pool shark. What can I do you for? He's happy because he's having sex. <laughs> oh, you know. I will bring the donuts. <laughs> mm. Oh, when? Oh, so the donuts were for you. Can oh my god, he's so cute. Why is there's no need for stress? Yeah, exactly. I'm comfortable. Somebody stole a Van Gogh? Oh. oh no, no, I mean I didn't see anything. No. I mean maybe Lyra did. But uh, listen, we're happy to help, but if I didn't actually witness anything, can I just hey, they have you on tape. Photogenic fella. <laughs> <laughs> when is so weird. Wait, where's my girlfriend? I don't know. Um They were having no. sex. That's it. You get how that looks. Yeah, I so do. Let's review. You can Oh, poor thing. He didn't do anything. Maggie knows that he didn't do anything. Where's that appetite of yours? They weren't goods to be traded. There's that famous Kryptonian exaggeration. <sighs> oh, oh yeah, that's him. They to used to the own the slaves. Because you stole them Those from the bitches. We liberated them. hardship. We gave them a path. Yeah, sure you How did, did you huh? Escape the blast. To make Daxon great again. Did they, did they just say make Jackson great again? So that you've forgotten. So they are like the Donald Trump. Pretty face. Here. Be reasonable. Why would you want to do that? My novel about me is integrity. You know, let's not argue about uh, words of old. What? You tell us of your journey and how you survived. Oh, we're gonna have flashbacks of Monel. Oh, look at that. He was in bed with someone else. What's going on? Please don't leave me! Reaper, come on! <laughs> hey, he just ran. Oh, great. Monel of Jackson. Oh, right, he was wearing a red shirt. This is your punishment. Oh, shit. But he still d did it. Nothing glorious or good Sorry. there or heroic. My son. 
You're so brave. And your guard dines what? at the gods' table. Hail, Monel. Oh shit. Troll in paradise. So you survived the first dinner with the fam. What? Seriously, you know, I, Monel? I'm sorry, okay? Can you really blame me for wanting to just be Monel, regular oh, guy from Daxamites? Wow. Well, how do you oh, feel about shit. Daxamites? If you had known, what to me? You didn't even give me the chance. Exactly. I've so many times, okay? I really did. What, is that supposed to make this better? Maybe yeah. the doesn't change anything. And how I feel about you. This changes everything. Everything. You lied. It's bad enough you lied, but... Of course I do. I can't even look at you. Oh, they're gonna boof past this. I'm sure. Hey, we got your call. Who's okay, out? A heads up next time would be nice before you arrest my friend. Come on, you know that's not how this yeah, works. Yeah, that's not how it works. Job and you, you think she set him up? Exactly. When's the last time you spoke to Lyra? I love how they are so in sync. I just love call that. Her all day. Let me guess her phone's disconnected. That's a station record. I need Aww. proof that you weren't involved. Or they're gonna pin this on you, and I won't be able to stop them. This proof you need, okay? Release Wind to us, okay? Give us four days. You can do hours. that? You want me to let my prime suspect walk? If we want to catch Lyra, then we need Win. Two days. Oh, Maggie. She always oh, does. Look at that. Looks like McConnell forgot to sign the warrant. You got 24 hours, a minute longer, and I'm coming for it myself. She femme fatale to me. Well, you certainly have a type. Yeah, he does! He always gets Thank like you. that. Oh, oh. <laughs> We've oh, this yes, yes, my yes. She's just not there. Uh, well, she was there, and I have the bruises. They're beautiful <laughs> bruises. And Shut up! Wait. Point to where they are. Wait, who are her people? Valerians. <laughs> yeah. Super friends! Oh! oh I have it! Oh, ouch, ouch. That's too much. Uh, but the super friends. Yes. No. But maybe he's just a guy who's ashamed of his past and he's looking for a fresh start. Talk Seriously? Him. Give him a chance to explain. Parzarel. Oh shit, bitch. Stand down! Stand down! Do not engage! Do not engage! Oh shit. I need to speak with you. Oh shit! I prefer to turn leadership skills. <laughs> oh my god, she's so nice. Are we all? Oh my god, Alex! Look at her licks! God damn it. Oh, she took a new world is quite stunning. He can be the face of that future. Oh yes, 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 take him! Take one now back to Texas. Yes! Would you rather he stay here and learn no. by degrees that he's not good enough for you? You don't know me. I know yeah. you're kind. I know what your integrity means. Oh, He's yeah, yeah, yeah. Just take him! Take him! I don't despise any Family first, you, you know? And he has no idea how unforgiving your people can be. You're actually helping, girl. <laughs> Make her see clarity so she can take him back. Wow. Oh, shit. She's fearless. Oh, when I'm so sorry. Okay, have your way. You're coming with us. Oh, you brought back oh. up. So did I. And mine kill. Did yours? Oh, no. Where's Alex? Why does he have to dress up like the Guardian to do this? Oh, she's going! Oh, shit. Don't hurt, Wynn! Oh shit! There she is! Oh my baby! Oh my god! Look! James with all that shit and Alex is just wearing her jacket! And she's still a badass! I love that! Oh shit! Thank you, good guardian! He's gonna go solo? You better don't. No! Oh, when? Trust me. When? Uh, this hey, is when they get hey, together? I've been doing some very serious research on human relationships, and by now, in the movie, the girl usually forgives the guy for whatever dumb thing he's done. I had a nice chat with your mother. 
fuck? Why did he keep saying those stupid things? What she want? You. You just throw that chance away because many of us don't get one. That is true. You know, you're, you're a prince. So just start acting like it. You can also be the prince you want to be. Please tell me it is. Did you paint a win? Is this a joke? Hey, hey, you're gonna have to go through me first, buddy. That's not hard. Criminals. Oh, just in time. What the hell do you do? That is yours. Run. Run, bitches, run. Oh my god. Jeez. Poor Jeez. Okay, he's strong, I guess. You humans all think you can be heroes. It's so annoying. <laughs> it really is. Yeah. Oh my god. Where's the D.O.? Oh, they said that they weren't gonna get involved. Can you stop breaking windows with James? Congratulations, you fare better than most. You should at least take that to your grave. Oh, there's the D.O., goddammit, I knew it. Oh, thank God. Nice job, guys. It took you long enough. Yeah, traffic was brutal. <laughs> oh. He's so cute! Were you gonna come along? Aww. No secrets. Yeah. Looks like I'm running off on you. <laughs> Go get him. Aww, that is so sweet! <laughs> that is so sweet! I love that. A ring of alien art thieves and the ah, ring of promised. Yeah. Ooh, good behavior to come. Oh. You're a good egg, Sawyer. Leave oh. before I throw you into holding for fun. <laughs> oh, Maggie, uh, I love you. I have better places to go. Yeah, you go. You scared him? Ah, oh, it's as good as I do. <laughs> Take me home. Oh, that was so sweet. So, Take um, me home. What's oh, next? I guess past you know, a new place. And a kiss? These two can keep their hands to each other. Aww, how sweet! She liked you. Yeah, she never reasons. You're just gonna forget about it? I mean, that's, that is a girl worth forgiving. Yeah, but it's not the same with... Stuff's going on with you, with you and Manel. Yeah. I'm, I'm not dumb, I see things. He has his reasons. I don't you like this. If those reasons are good enough for you or not. Yeah. I don't like everyone to keep pushing, like, just forgive the boy. No, she doesn't want forgiving. She shouldn't. Do I'm not gonna tell lie that lie myself in. God. Of course not. You get yourself in whatever you want, boy. It means I get to spend every single day by your side. Again, he loves it because no, it honest, gives something to him. I'm gonna shut up. And the way that you you fight, and I love you. Oh, whoa. Is it a little too soon? I have. I, I love you. Isn't that a little too soon, You're so Mona? Special. I know that. I deserve better than being lied to. You do. Oh, you and do I'm deserve lying. better. I'm sorry for that. She's gonna forgive him. Are you ever gonna tell me the truth? I don't know. Yeah, you can know now. You know what? At least he didn't lie right there. The puppy's crying. You just want things to be easy. Oh, oh, I can't. I can't do this. No, it's over. <gasps> Shit. Really? You do. Mom. You do, do you, girl. I hope you're doing it for the right reasons, you know? Oh, baby. Why is she crying? 
There he is. Son, he's not our typical guest. So uh, this is this how we start the uh, musical. Oh, he looks fun. Darling Chris. Oh, there you are. Blaine, I thought I saw the last uh, of you. To who, me? She's funny. What? I've been looking for you. Oh, no. He's evil. Evil Blaine. What the hell? Supergirl. What the hell? Oh, shit. Ladies and gentlemen, this what? division has been so much fun. And Shoot him! I gotta go chase down the fastest man alive. Why? Toodles! Oh, someone grab her! Oh, thanks, Moon now. Are you okay? Cora. Cora? Cora, can you hear us? Oh, yeah, she gets into a dream sequence, right? Oh, shit. Cora. You look Cora. good. <laughs> what is it? Canceled on us. You got the bump. He's giving you me a kid. I go on, go on, go on. <laughs> oh shit! You're gonna sing. <laughs> oh shit! Okay, guys, that was the end of episode 16 of season two of Supergirl. Um. You know what? I don't I there's one thing I don't understand with the storyline. Why in the world will you want to have a, a storyline in a group of people that resemble so much of Donald Trump who is a person who goes against everything the show used to stand for. I, I, that part I just don't get. I don't even think it's fair to the actors. I don't think it's fair to Monel's character. I'm not a comic book fan. Um, I, I don't know Monel's story. I don't know if his story on the show is the same one on the comics. I do not know that. Um, but just focusing on the show, what you could have an arc with Monel, you know, being the prince of Daxim, just having, you know, that 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 arc and he lying to to Carr and all that. Uh, but having her his parents even say, you know, we're gonna make Daxim great again and things like that, they are just not a joke to a lot of people in America and I am not in the United States but sadly all things that happen in the United States affects the rest of the world so how can you do that and this is not me bashing on Monel this has nothing to do with Monel because for the sake of drama of course you gotta have that you know of course they're gonna break up do I believe the breakup is gonna last no because Car is actually really into him and once she realized that yes she's judging him from his past that he lied to her at least he wants to be better you know but right now I think the fact that uh, Monel's not being like not being with Kara we're gonna see his true self you know we're gonna see if he really wants to become a hero because so far the reasons why he wants to become a hero are just because he wants to spend time with Kara he has nothing to gain over being uh, a hero just he wants to impress the girl He's still, if you take that, he's still being selfish because he's still thinking about him. And that's why his heart is never on the battle. That's why he makes so many mistakes. That's why he doesn't listen to Kara. That's why he doesn't do the things a hero should do, you know? Uh, but closing that idea that I had at the beginning, I don't, I don't like this storyline where you redeem the bad guy from what is happening in like current time 
you know, you don't need to redeem Donald Trump, you know, I don't, I just, I, that, that, that storyline bugs me a lot, but now, focusing on the episode, yes, Monel lied, and we have known for a long time since he arrived to, uh, the town, the town, what the hell, to Earth, uh, we already knew that Monal felt bad about everything that happened. And the more, more he is on this planet and the more he realized how things should work, uh, Monal has tried to be less of the prince and become someone who he wants to be. Um, he there's a thing right there that Monel says a lot of good things but then he acts differently you know he says that he doesn't want to be the same selfish person he used to be because he was thought that he that's the only thing he knew and um, you have to understand that during this entire season all we have seen him do is make selfish choices, you know, uh, because he doesn't do anything he's not gaining something from, so far. I'm not saying the character is not gonna grow, I'm not saying the character is evil, no, of course not, but um, his progress is a little... I'm glad right now that they have broke up, break, breaking up. Not because I want Car to date someone else, no, because I think it will give Monel the time to actually be who he wants to be uh, for the right reasons, you know, help people for the right reasons, not because he wants to impress Kara, you know, I want him to actually, you know, do it for the right reasons, and if he doesn't want to do it also, if he doesn't want to be a hero, then you can't hold it against him, you know, he just doesn't want to, and whatever, he might have powers, but he doesn't want to be a hero, it's not on him, then we shouldn't, like, uh, criticize him for that, I feel, you know. Um, I don't know, it's just so, so weird to see how much, this is another thing that I don't like, it's about how much um, character development Monel has had uh, on a show that is named and titled Supergirl and I feel like yes the story has gone like completely away from Supergirl herself and being more about Supergirl's love interest in this case is Monel I don't like that I don't like that because also the writers are saying that this season was supposed to be uh, since Supergirl's already Supergirl, this season was going to be about Supergirl making him a hero. I'm not comfortable with that, um, so yeah, I just wanted to say that. Um, what else? I mean, I, I, I agree with, with Monel of, of him realizing, when you live in a, in, in, in a society, I guess, where everyone tells you what you're doing is right, where people are just, you know, um, telling you how great you are and how nothing you're doing is wrong and growing up like that because you have to understand there's a big difference between Monel and Kara. Monel has lived until his 20s on Daxim and he has lived there and uh, he has grown so much on a culture that says that everything he was doing was right. It is, it is going to be really difficult for him to just get rid of everything he thought and he thought were, was right and, you know, say everything was wrong and I have to learn everything again. That is a point that I will give to Mo now. But again, he was an adult, he's an adult, you know, so he should make smarter decisions. He should stop, the writer should stop making him say the most 
misogynistic things in the planet. It's like, how can we get everyone to get mad at Mona? Okay, let's make him say that in the movie, but that by this time, the girl already forgave the guy. Why will you want to do that? Why? It's just, like I have said in many other reviews, shows are not in a bubble. You, they don't live in a bubble, you know? Everything that happens is take as a role model for people watching it at home. So, if you want to set up an example, like Supergirl did back on season one, then why do you have such a nice person? Because Chris Wood actually is a really nice guy. Why will you want him to be hated by a group of the fans? Because I don't condemn, like, I don't approve of hate if you want to send, uh, a, 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 like, a... a a harsh review to, to the writers, do so in a polite way. Also, the actors are not the characters, so don't take it on the actors, you know. But why will you have him say things like that? Why will you want to just be as far away from what season one built? You know, it's just so ridiculous and so stupid. And you make people want to hate the character. And I'm here, I don't want to hate Monel. I honestly don't want to hate Monel because I'm a fan of Supergirl. If Kara, Supergirl, if she's happy, I'm happy. Sadly, this happiness comes in the form of Monel. I will choose someone else for Kara, yes, but right now it's Monel. And I do want Kara to be happy. And if that happiness, like I said, comes in the form of Monel, I am going to be all for it. But make him a good person, you know? Someone who does, like, who Supergirls deserve. Not the prince who now is just going rogue against his parents and all that shit. I just don't like it. I think they can write a better storyline for Supergirl. That's all. I mean... I, I just, honestly, right now, I do see Monel getting into, like, that last last scene with Monel carrying her, I didn't like that, but I do see Monel finally taking charge of his life. If he wants to be someone good, he can be because he is the prince and he can lead his people now in a good way because he has learned a lot of things. Uh, will it be difficult? Yes. But I don't think they're gonna get rid of Mona. So, um, I don't know where what, where the character's gonna go now that he's... You have to understand this. Now, uh, yes, he's still his love interest, but now they are breaking up. So, his appearance time should cut short. <laughs> I don't know. I just, I don't like the fact that people... Oh, God. The people, uh, that the writers make, uh, Monel such a, make such a stupid comments, honestly. If they can read, read, like, uh, get rid of the stupid comments, I will be completely fine with Monel. Um, uh, but yeah, yeah, it's, it, it's kind of sad to see, uh, his character the way he used to be and, how he seemed like he got bothered by the things that were happening, but he still got along. Also, the the talk that uh, Monel's mom had with Kara, saying, "Oh, you you know, putting uh, Kara saying, yeah, of course, Crypt Kryptonians are not good with forgiveness," and getting back to the whole. Kara doesn't forgive Monel because he's from Daxam and she's from Kryptoni, Krypton and you know the fight and all that um, I don't know it's just, there's not enough of enough reasons for Kara to not forgive him you know yes he lied yes she deserves better but at the end she's gonna give him a puppy look and she's gonna take him back I am sure of it but I hope that by the time happen, Monel is actually a bigger person and a more, uh, I don't know, good person, I guess. I, I honestly don't know where the hell that storyline is going. Also, we had, it was all about testing relationships, you know. 
Uh, especially Kara's Mon and Monel's relationship and Lyra and Wynn. What is the ship name for those two? Wira or something like that? What is the ship name? I do not know. Uh, but I like them. I like them so much. I, it's like, if there's a straight ship I'm gonna ship on this show, I'm gonna ship this too because they are so cute. Uh, I'm, I'm, you know what I'm sad for? <laughs> James. Like, they don't know what to do with a character. Like, you have James being the guardian with his voice like really deep in that changing voice thing. You know, and with his, uh, what is that, shield and all that shit. And he gets beaten up by two guys and then comes Alex wearing her leather jacket and it starts kicking ass. What is the point of putting then Jim James with a guardian suit and all that shit? What is the point? It, there's no point for James right now. Why did they have done these things to James? Honestly, it's just like so stupid. It's so stupid, honestly. They are just like... Okay, we don't know what to do with James. Let's just make him fight like a crazy person. Oh, by the way, let's break a lot of glass with him also and then throw him around. Like, this, it's so stupid. I miss James because James was actually a good guy. He actually did help uh, Kara, but I think the fact that Kara is now a hundred percent on the DO and also Win being on the DO, they don't need the super friends to help Kara individually without getting the DO O's help. Which is sad, you know? It's sad what they are doing to, to them. But the storyline with Wynn and Lyra, it was kind of cute. Oh my god. She was just trying to save her brother. And that's why, you know, the circumstances have made her a bad girl. And then comes good Wynn and he's gonna, like, uh, try to... Wait, what am I saying? Oh, she's he's gonna try to, you know, make her a bit of person and in the process Lyra is gonna make him a more secure person and I love when you know on relationships they both support each other and I'm like oh my god and it's so cute it's so cute like there are there's nothing wrong right now with Win and, and Lyra I'm sure they're gonna find a reason to fuck this up but right now I'm shipping them and let me know on the comment section down below what is with like the ship name between those two? I want to know. I don't know. Is it Wira? Yeah, I don't. I don't know. <laughs> I'm terrible at making uh, ship names. Uh, what else happened in the episode? Oh, we have our two minutes. Is it two minutes? Is it two minutes though? I think it was like a minute of uh, Sam Bersley were cuddling. Oh, can you imagine all the gifts we're gonna have? All the fan fiction we're gonna have with those two minutes. We're creative people, guys. Uh, and what else? I love that they always support each other. I love that Maggie always, you know, puts the line, you know, I do my job my way, you do your job your way. But she still supports her girlfriend because, you know, a pretty girl who tells you to do something, you're gonna do it, just like Wynn said. Uh, so, yeah. It was kind of funny that, you know, because she was like, how can you do this for a girl? And then the her girl comes in and says, give me 24 hours. And she's like, bitch, I'm going to do it. <laughs> because, you know. Uh, but I love that they support each other. I love how... I love that last part, too, where um, Maggie is like, do you think I scared him? And she was like, Alex, what's like a proud girlfriend? Yes, you did, honey. And then she said, take me home. Oh. Anyways, I'm such a... Oh, God. I hope next episode is actually a lot more Samber-centric. I, I hope that... Can we have, like, five minutes? Oh, five minutes. Just five minutes. There's a 43 minutes episode. Just five minutes. Five minutes of Sambers. Please, five minutes. Like, like that's all... But Sambers. Like, Sambers. Just Sambers. You know, just five minutes. I'm not asking for, my, for more. Just a five. <laughs> it's just that we haven't had that since... When? I, I, I don't remember, like Sambers, just Samber scenes. I don't remember. I think they had more scenes when they weren't a couple than now that they are actually a couple. Come on, just five minutes. 
That's all I ask. Just five minutes of Sambers that I can rewatch and rewatch and rewatch until the new episode. That's all I ask. It's not much. Just two minutes is just too little, you know? Just five. Just give me five minutes. Anyway, <laughs> I'm kind of crazy right now, but yeah. The episode was good. The episode in general was good. You know, Carl got to meet the family also. That was good. Monel's coming, you met the fam. <laughs> that was really funny. Um, but yeah, I honestly, now that Monel is, uh, everything about Monel is out there in the clear, you know, now Monel can focus on being a good person for himself and not for anything that comes with a reward for him. That's it. That's gonna make him a good person and then Kara is gonna say, oh, you know what, this boy, he actually wants to, ch not change, but compromise. No, change, because he does need to change some things. And we're gonna go, and I'm gonna like him again, and I'm gonna take him back, and Monel's gonna say, you didn't want me, I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. But I honestly do want someone good for Kara. And if that's Monel, then go for it, Monel. Be a good person, and then take your girl back. What? That sounded so bad. I'm so sorry. I don't know. I'm in a weird mood right now. But yeah. Anyways, I liked the episode. I hope that you guys enjoyed this reaction and rambling at the end. I don't know what the hell is it that I just said. I hope everything makes sense. But if you want to talk, we can talk in the comment section down below. Also on Twitter, my handle is at JulieDG. Have an Instagram. I bet you don't know that I have a Facebook page. You can check it out. You can give it a like. Link on the description below. I also have a Patreon. You can also check it out. Link on the description below. What else do I have? I have a Tumblr. I have a Snap Snapchat. Tumblr Snapchat. Oh, I have Curious Cat. That you can ask me questions. And anonymous. And I can answer. So you can, you know, send me questions there too, if you want. I don't know. I am in such a weird mood right now. But yeah. Thumbs up for this video if you love Supergirl and if you think Supergirl deserves a good guy that Monel is not there yet, but he will soon. Give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe to see more reaction videos and comment. Yes, comment. And I'll see you guys next time for another reaction video for Supergirl. Mwah. Bye guys.